Praise the children's creativity. Brain science. Light and shadow are best friends. The sun rose brightly over the eastern sky on its shining chariot. The sun looked down at the world and said under its breath, "Okay." Here's to another day. First, the sun pushed away the darkness, then woke up the people and the animals. Then the sun warmed up the world. A while later, the sun called out to its friends, "Hey, come on out. Let's have fun." The sun shone its bright light over the land. The birds flew up to the sky and answered, "We have to go and eat breakfast." The plants in the fields waved their leaves and said, "We're busy now. We have to absorb water, mix it with light and carbon dioxide, then make nutrients out of them." Just then, the sun noticed someone hiding behind the tree. Who is it? The sun craned its neck to look closely, but no matter how hard the sun tried to take a look, it keeps hiding behind the tree. Who are you? Come out and play with me. When the sun called out, it answered, "No, I can't come out to see you." Why? You don't like me? No, I like you. If you go away, I'll die. The sun couldn't understand what it was saying. If it liked the sun, why wouldn't it come out to meet the sun? Isn't that weird? Okay, then just tell me your name. I'm the shadow. Okay, shadow. Why are you hiding from me? That's because I'm embarrassed. My face is always dark, and my clothes are all black. Its voice sounded sad. The sun felt sorry for him, so it decided to play with the shadow. Dear shadow, do you want to play with me? The shadow was taken aback. The sun was handsomely bright, and the shadow was dark and gloomy. It's not something that happens every day. Really? I'm good at hide and seek. The gloomy voice of the shadow took on a cheery note. I'll be it then, shadow. You go hide. Just then, the cloud appeared and butted in. Hmm. So you two want to have fun by yourselves? Well, I'll make that hard for you. The cloud blocked the sun's face. At the same moment, the shadow also disappeared. You naughty cloud! Are you at it again? Get out of here! The wind ran over to scold the cloud. Hmm. You always pick on me. The cloud ran away, grumbling. Thank you, wind. The sun smiled.
Now, son, go ahead and find me. After the cloud went away, someone started to sing. Then more voices joined in. They were the shadows appearing everywhere. You're all here now. Okay, go ahead and hide. The tree shadow and its friends all took their places. There are lots of hiding places. Behind the big zakova tree, in front of the village, under a child's red tricycle, they hid and crouched everywhere that there was an object. Okay, are you all done hiding now? I'm coming. The sun dived into the glass doors on its chariot, but there was no shadow in there. This time, it went inside a transparent plastic umbrella, but there wasn't a shadow in there too. Where are they all hiding? They've really outdone themselves. Then, a tree pointed its branches to where a shadow was hiding. I got it. Thank you, tree. The sun grinned and winked. Then it pretended to not have found the shadow and went towards the tree. But then. The sun's chariot crashed into the tree. Ouch! What just happened? Thankfully, the chariot was not broken. But how embarrassing! The sun could hear the shadows giggling quietly from everywhere behind the tree, under the tricycle, under a child's red shoes. But the sun couldn't find any of them. Why? Because the objects were blocking the chariot's way. I give up. I lose. Finally, the sun surrendered. The shadows replied while still hiding. You'll never be able to find us. That's right. We're always behind something, and only when you're shining very brightly. Huh? I can't see you, even if I want to. So we're like Altair and Vega, never able to meet each other ever. The sun laughed bitterly. Even Altair and Vega can meet once a year on the night of July seventh, but we can't. I can't believe that there's a place where I can't go, even with my shiniest, fastest chariot. We're really a world apart. That day, before it was time to say goodbye, the sun told the shadows. We can't see each other's faces, but cheer up! Everyone loves the cool shadows and the hot summers. Thank you for telling us that, dear.